all right my correct people and i welcome back again to anointed lady tv and i don't come your side with another obunge and legitimate informate we i would like share give all of honor and the coco now about the national shutdown as the nlc plus tuc nationwide strike it don't take effect there be small matter of my correct people now say the strike where the organized labor for inside the country nigeria then declare it don't take effect as they may announce them on friday already some affiliate unions don't they tell their members say May them comply with the nationwide strike where they start on Monday. Now, the transmission company of the country, Nigeria, the Yantu, said too, say them go shut down the national grid. And this now why lights no good day for many parts of the country, Nigeria, plus the National Union of Electricity Employees. They will not release their own statement to where they announce it, they won't join the strike. Say the withdrawal of their services will start on Sunday, will be 2nd of June by 12 midnight this now according to how dominic igwe bk will be the ag general secretary teyana mama correct people meanwhile the nigerian union of petroleum and natural gas workers you know they talk to say themselves they join the strike action no and this one now the for his statements where the general secretary will be comrade a full abi olawale sign then say because as union say that they worried over the insensitive response of the federal government on the matter of negotiating new minimum wage. No be small while I'm correct people. No say on Sunday, eh, members of the National Assembly they be meet with the members of the Nigerian Labour Congress will be NLC and the Trade Union Congress will be TUC to see how they will take quench the strike. But it no bear fruit. It in it no work at all at all. Tori be say the meeting it lasts for over four hours. You know, end well as the TUC Chamo in Commot Congo tell journalists say the nationwide strike it go get head and it don't still get head of my correct people. According to how the president of the TUC the trade union congress in him na first Osifo, according to how he and give to the people, instead there are already plaster for their decision no, say since the national minimum wage negotiation exercise never they concluded and the agreed wage never they passed into law, say the hike in electricity tariff never they reversed. And the categorization of consumers into bands never stop as demanded. Say Nigerian workers now, then they compelled by this failure to embark on one indefinite nationwide industrial action. We will begin on Monday, maybe the third of June, for this year, 2024, to press home our demands. Nico Kono and the Oma Correct Person is plenty. Make us the new another legit. No, say the unions did they demand. 494,000 naira, that is $370 per month as the new minimum wage, sake of the current reality. But Nigerian government and organized private sector, they, they offer to pay 60,000 naira, will be $45,000 per month. I'm a correct people, and I know say currently, for every country in Nigeria, now 30,000 naira, now be the minimum wage. Oh. I'm a shock you, no be all states self they pay the money, no be small matter, oh, my correct people. No, say still on still, the Minister for Information and National Orientation, in him now, Mohamed Idris, in cause the year no say, the sum of 494,000 naira national minimum wage, where the labor unions they demand, say, you know, they sustainable. Oga okay, Idris now, we talk this one during one press conference like that for inside Abuja, will be the country capital, in cause they explain, say, the amount where the union they, they ask if it scatter the country economy. Normally, eh, I know say this the way Oga Idris talk just now, he go pain plenty of people for inside the country, Nigeria. They don't go smile based on waiting in just yan. But make a tell you on that, we go just para you the more. No say for inside one statement like that, police call the ask the labor groups. Say make they no rush their plan strike oh, because if it creates hardship for country people, we feel cause kasala. This they come from police FPRO ACP, we be Olumo Yiwa Adejobe. He say, even though we sabi say organized labor gets right to do strike to ginger for the interest of all workers because federal government don't call the plan strike say it is illegal and premature. Say the Nigerian police force now they look this action as potential cause for more tension and political instability. My correct people, it is quite unfortunate to say the police who they the fear say these labor unions that strike if you bring more katakata, if you bring more instability, if you cause kasala to country people. But then fail to recognize, say, this federal government, their minimum wage eh, is too small. It no rich. It don't already cost Kassala to country people. It don't already plaster hardship. It don't already bring basic on board into the table of many country people. Now make the commerce I can say, oh, more, enough is enough. 
Shapa le make a yani on how this kasala, how this matter of this NLC palava it is starts. No say the orgas of the labor unions we don't try reach agreement for the new minimum wage with federal government before the end of May, but it no work out. Labor now they, they ask for four hundred and ninety seven thousand naira as minimum wage, but federal government they say lie lie, you no go feel pay that kind of money. You no go pay anything way past sixty thousand naira. At first, the Nigerian government they been proposed to add eighteen thousand naira to the current thirty thousand naira additional minimum wage to make them forty eight thousand for the new minimum wage according to the leadership of the organized labor. But the NLC will be Nigerian Labor Congress and the TUC will be Trade Union Congress. They say lie lie, say they no go agree, say the money too small. Say if no be 494,000 naira, say make them leave them. Now on Friday will be 31st of May, now the Nigerian Labor Congress will be NLC and the Trade Union Congress will be TUC. They've been declared say indefinite strike will begin from Monday, sake of the increase in electricity tariff plus the government inability to reach agreement with them on the new minimum wage. Like this now, Emma, correct people, the labor union, they don't plaster their mind though. They don't make up their mind, say, oh, more, if no be this money, will they demand, eh, more could I just live on like that. Either than this money or nothing. Then on top of the matter, the Minister for Information and National Orientation will be Mohamed Idris Nkone Yano say, the sum of this 494,000 naira national minimum wage with the labor union that they demand say you know the sustainable. Okay, it is said the wage with the labor that they ask for say all together it the amount to the sum of 9.5 trillion naira bill. And if it destabilize the economy plus if it affects the welfare of over 200 million country people. Okay, it is consider the no say Nigerians need to understand say. Although government eh, then desire big salary for Nigerian workers, so say what thing they important pass for our president will be Bola Ametinibu be say him no want action will fit lead to massive job loss. As the labor union then hear this one omo, they move straight go to journalists inside go to tell them say omo this uh, strike it go go ahead though make us just know this and no peace since the federal government they never ready until the request will be carried come. Then Oga Idris can beg the organized labor. Some of them come back to the negotiation table. Some of them can negotiate and make them try to agree reasonable and realistic wages for their members. So my current people now saw the matter take play oh, like this now. The strike it only cause serious buzz for inside many parts of the country, Nigeria, even for inside airports. And if you manage to see lights for your area or more, thank God proper because get a CB for other places for inside the country, Nigeria. Oh. And as I'm talking to you right now, Emma Kora people, both ASU, both SSANU, both NUT, and others, they don't join the nationwide strike. So now, so the Coco be like Emma Kora people, you know, say this now, Anointed Lady TV. You all they like give you a bonge and legitimate news. On the things and things will happen for inside with country Nigeria. So if you never subscribe to this channel, make it go subscribe and make it turn on the notification bell. So that as we bring the news they come, then go first get the updates and go get them sharp sharp. And make it try to share the news to your family and friends so that then too they go know what they play for inside with country Nigeria. And they bring on that update for human country people. No go anywhere.